Hello Lullas, welcome back to my channel. Guys, if you're new to this channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. I am super, super, super duper excited. This is my last baby for 2022. Um, this baby is from Linda, uh, from Birdie Babies um, collection. And she is, I will go, I will tell you who she is in just a second. I'm trying to unbutton this sweater because I think I'm going to put her on this little sweater. But this baby is so beautiful. I didn't do a box opening because it was basically she came with her paperwork, her blanket, like, you know, the stuff that was with her, you know, um, not. You know anything fancy but let me tell you something <laughs> oh my gosh i think people are really missing out on some amazing babies at a great price um she is uh, let's see i'm gonna zoom in a little bit i just i don't know if it's a show but she has beautiful veining beautiful modeling her color is, oh my gosh, her toning is amazing. She looks so freaking real. It is crazy, crazy, crazy. Like, I love her. I already got a name for her. Hopefully she can fit this. I don't know. That's something I had here. I may lose a little light for a minute, and I'm going to go over the information. I just want to put her on a little sweater. It's actually cool here today. So, and... Forgive my ashy arms. <laughs> I got dry skin right now. Um, looks like I need a water softener in my house because, baby, oh, my hands are so dry, ashy. Um, <clears throat> I work because I'm working with silicone right now and, and everything. I'm probably drying out my hands a lot from all the washing back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. So that happens. But anyway, um, I just think she's so, she's softly painted, but very detailed. Um, so I think her artist came, it's from Russia. Um, I did not know like the artist who the artist was or anything. This just happened to be one of those babies that me and Linda would talk about. And um, I never told Linda this. I don't think I might have because we talked, said so many things. But I always felt like this baby kind of reminded me, looked like Linda. And I always thought maybe that's why she picked her out subconsciously because we always pick out babies that remind us of you know like something familiar ourself our children or <clears throat> nieces nephews that type stuff and sometimes we're not even aware of why we like it i had wet her hair a little bit too but it looks so much better once it dry this part because that part is still kind of damp this part is not the front this part so like so she has a a light brown hair oh my god and it's beautifully rooted I haven't decided how I want to style it but I think it's supposed to go kind of similar to the way it's styled right now um so yeah I was afraid I wasn't gonna like the sculpt I I always loved the painting I always used to tell Linda I really loved the painting on this baby um I'm so yeah she has a lot of like her her veining is beautiful her coloring is beautiful like she she looks so realistic I'm gonna put her on some sockies she'll probably stay in I don't know if these socks are gonna work for her or not but um she'll probably not get changed a lot but she is man she is stunning 
so I'm gonna tell you guys who she is. I had to look her up and then when I looked up the artist photos, I was like, whoa, that baby looks way better than the photos that's out there. So I said, I, I, I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I gotta get this one. So I went on and got that one. And <laughs> I know she needs pants, don't worry. All right, so this is her sculpt. That picture on the sculpt is <laughs> crazy. And that's what I was worried. I was like, oh my God, the head is so huge. It looked like one of those waterhead babies. And I was like, oh uh, no. So it's 137 out of 650. We don't see these type of editions hardly ever. It is Esme by Cassie Fr Brace. It's a sold out, sold out kit. Very sold out. Um, in fact, I've just seen one sale for almost 300 blank the other day. Um, I don't know if this picture was in there, but <laughs> I'll keep it because it looks vintage. Um, so this is the, like, I guess she had a book that came with her. Let's see what it says. Reborn artist Tatiana Melnikova. Um... And so, yeah, so it just, this just kind of says that that's the, the artist name there. So, what else? Oh, it's like, like firstborn. Oh, and I do have this outfit. This outfit was with her. That outfit. And it's like the artist photos. So, I'll just style her hair a little bit but yeah she has this picture show her more like yellowy and stuff like that she's more pinky very I don't know she's very real <laughs> so um and oh yeah it's a business card that came with her nursery heart to heart um here we go let's see Yeah, so, yeah, um, she's, uh, softly varnished and everything, um, she's, she's gorgeous though, I really, really love her, um, yeah, I really, really love her, her hair is beautifully rooted, she's beautifully painted, she's a good size, I'm actually not, like, her feet are really like kind of on the small size but she's petite for the most part she's like a she has a chubby face but she's more of a petite baby and she has this one leg that's bent which doesn't bother me um I actually really like it and I don't know it's like things that normally would bother me is not bothering me um I think she is I don't know I feel like she's proportioned she just a baby that have a bigger like head um which is kind of happens um or i had big head babies i guess i don't know but um it's not like it's unnaturally big i like this i like this baby i like the face i like everything about her so i have named her i decided i named her before she even came because i I could tell that she was going to look like a Penny. So her name is Penny. And so welcome Penny to my nursery, guys. I hope you guys love her. I'm going to sh probably share like outfits of the day occasionally with her. But oh my gosh, I got to find her somewhere to like just be like displayed in here. I'm so crowded now with so many babies. I'm a little overwhelmed to have so many babies. I, pro I probably should be selling some of them, but I haven't. Um, so I don't even know what number this makes me have. I have over 25, I know, at this point. But I just, I just wanted you guys to see her. Like she is very lovely. Just thought I'd. Look at her legs. I love the way her legs are painted. Her feet are nice. 
too. I love her feet. Her feet are nice. Let me show you. Her feet are really nice. I'll have to put that back on. But, and I like her hands. I love like in, like Brayden hand is painted like this. This is so funny because she has a lot of coloring. Um, kind of reminds me of Brayden a little bit when it comes to like her hands and stuff like that. But oh my gosh, I love her. So that is Penny. All right, guys, let me know what you guys think about her. Um, I'm so excited. Um, if you are also, if you are looking to get you an affordable baby that come from like really exquisite artists, um, I mean, at a price, you'll never get a baby at the prices these babies are going for. Um, check out Lindy Turnip Seed on Facebook. Um, she is listing them. She has photos all there. And you can message her. If you don't find it, message me. I can direct you to her and help you. But yeah. Alright, that's it.